Hi everyone, this is Abhishek here and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to edit your website homepage. In my last video, I have already shown you how to install a WordPress, how to install a plugin, how to create course, how to create a payment gateway. Now in this video, I'm going to show you how to edit this sample homepage that has been installed while activating our theme. Okay, so let's get started. First of all, I would like to show you, see if I click on this play button, nothing is going to happen. There is no video. All right. If I click on this sign up button, nothing is going to happen. If I click on browse tutorial, nothing is going to happen because these are the only buttons. These buttons are not linked with any other pages. So we are going to customize each and everything you are able to see in this particular one home page. So first of all, you have to log into your WordPress dashboard. And once you log into your WordPress dashboard, you will get this particular one menu bar. So this is my home page. So let's click on edit with Elementor. Don't click on edit page. You have to click on edit with Elementor. Okay. Now step number one, first of all, I'm going to uh, add a intro video on this page. So let's click on this pencil icon. And here you can see one option called link, right? So here only we have to add our YouTube video link. So for showing you example, I have already make a notes about all the links and all that I have to share. So this is my intro video link that is available on my YouTube channel. So let's copy it from here. And let's paste here. Done. Okay. Now let's link the sign up page. Click on this button. And in the link section, you have to add a student registration page. Now, where can we find the student registration page? It is very, very simple, guys. See, this is our home page. Just open your student registration page. This is the link. Copy from here and let's paste here. Done. Now, let's click on Browse Tutorial. In this section, if you want, you can add your video tutorials or for example, I'm going to add my course link. All right. Now, where can we find our course link? It's very simple. Let's go to our course page. Open our course. Just copy this link. And let's paste here. Done. Let's go down. Here we have our boxes, right? In these boxes, I want to add my custom message. For example, step number one this section right so let's click on edit delete this text from here and here i want to add this one user friendly language let's copy from here paste it here and in this section i am going to copy this particular one line copy and paste that's it. Now in this section, let's select it here. Delete everything. And here I want to add this section practical lab access. Let's copy and paste. Here. Delete everything. Copy. And paste. It is very simple, right? This is done just in a few minutes, right? Now let's click on preview changes from here. And let's click on this video button. And boom, it is working fine. If we click on sign up, it is working fine. Let's go back. And if I click on browse tutorials, it should open our course page. Okay, fantastic. And let's go down. And see all of these changes has been updated successfully, right? It is looking quite good. Now we are going to change these sections. So first of all, whatever changes we have made, let's click on update. So that our setting is going to save. Now let's edit our trending tutorial sections. See in this section, if you want, you can add your slides. So you can change your images. You can add your videos, whatever you like. All right. Or, or else you can also add your website post. So I am telling you the basic things for, for showing you the tutorial. I am going to add my YouTube video. All right. So what you have to do is just click at the top. 
or you can just right click in this section and click on edit column and go to style under style you can see the image right so let's click on choose image click on select files and I'm going to add first of all this image click on open click on if you want you can give your alt text that is good for your SEO SEO I will teach you some other day first of all I'm going to show you how you can customize this home page all right okay, click on insert media done okay now in this section also I want to change my image so right click click on edit column style click on change image I am going to upload files select files and here I want to add this option Ethernet cable let's click on open done click on insert media done okay now this text also you can add manually for example click here and in this section I want to add what is IP address copy paste done and here you can add the trainer name okay or if you want you can also delete it so for example trainer name is Abhishek Gupta that's me here you can insert few lines uh, what is this topic is all about all right for example in this video you are going to learn the basics of IP address none so same like this you can customize all of these fields got it now same like this if you click on start here right so the time the person click on start here it is going to open your video so I am going to insert again my YouTube video link let's copy from here and paste in this section done so how cool is your website is looking right now let's click on preview and if we go down as you can see everything has been updated successfully and if somebody click on start here it is going to open my youtube video got it so in this section instead of applying your youtube channel link it's better you can open your website some post link so that nobody will go outside your website see this is a youtube video right so you are sending someone from your website to youtube website so these things are not good for your website so it's better instead of sharing directly youtube video link you should share your website post got it all right let's go down and in this section also you can do customize manually but currently on my website i am teaching only networking plus so i'm not i'm not going to touch all of these options all right let's go down and here is a user feedback so if you want you can customize these things you can also customize this image uh, as of now i don't want to customize any of these things at the end we can customize this section let's delete from here and i want to add this line sign up today and get a chance to enroll our course with lifetime access so it is a eye catchy and in this sign up today button i'm going to add again the our sign up page so let's click on edit in link i want to add the sign up button so where can i find the sign up button let's open the student registration page copy this page link and let's paste it here that's it now let's click on preview changes see guys whenever you before doing update you must check the preview changes whether the thing is working correctly or not because once you update it is very difficult to undo the changes on your website step number one let's test the video section it is working fine let's click on sign up button boom it is also working fine and let's test this browse tutorial option all right looking great now let's go down all of these changes has been made successfully as you can see and our website is most probably looking beautiful here is our post let's click on start here all right 
it is working great and and at the end let's go to bottom the text has been updated let's click on sign up today okay so all of these settings has been updated successfully and this is how easily you can customize your website home page i hope you have enjoyed watching this video kindly hit the like button and if you are new to this channel kindly subscribe it and also hit the bell icon thanks for watching